What up? What up? Yo, yo, easy, man. You know, you popped it down. Shit. Are you recording? Yeah, this is for my in that was for my intro entrance. Intro entrance. Well, you would you have seen his intro entrance. You would have popped on the green screen. Oh yeah. Bang Diggs on his back. What up? What up? It's your boy Diggers. And your girl Keeves, and welcome back to life with Diggs and Keeves. Nah, nah, we gonna change our name. <laughs> My name's Keeves, man. It's your boy Diggers, and it's your girl Keebers. <laughs> <laughs> No, 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 my name is Keys. I don't know about Kibbers. And welcome back to, to Life, Life with Digs and Keys. <laughs> As you can tell, we are back with another episode of Combo, Combo and, and Chill. Chill. Yeah. Mm. If you haven't seen our little series that we've been doing, go make sure to go back and follow our little journey. We, this is what our third Combo and Chill now, making it into like a little series thing. We got mm -hmm. so much cars to get through. Yep. So why not? You know. Um, might even add our own little combo to continue once we get bored of the cards or whatever. We might even just end up getting our own little questions or combo starters to keep keep the series going. Mm -hmm. But to combo and chill themselves, if you want to send us out like the new of because we're gonna get through these soon, innit? That's why we're we're doing this every two weeks. I would say we're doing yeah, this. Yeah, two weeks. Yeah. So yeah, because. We don't want to just skip through it real quick. But if you want to keep us mo with that momentum going, then sh be sure to send it to out to us. I know you've got other versions, I'm pretty sure. So yes. that would be great. Without further ado... Did I say that correct? Say what correct? Without further... Yeah. Ah, okay. <laughs> well, without that... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get into the video. Yeah. So, did we shuffle? Or what? I don't know. I That's don't why know. I'm literally just gonna split the deck on on cam a couple times. Yeah, cause I can't remember what happened last These time. These cards are a bit sticky. Look, well, they're fresh. Look. Uh. They're fresh. All right, so boom. I'm ready. All right, let's go. Top card, yeah. Yep. Mm. What is your favorite documentary? Favorite documentary. I don't have a favourite documentary. I don't think I have one either, to be honest. No. I don't really watch them kind of things. Mm. You used to. You used to watch, like, them animal programs. Animal? I swear you, oh, you, used, to, I swear you used to say you like them things. You used wrong, to watch... Wrong girl. Wrong girl. Oh. Oh, wrong girl. I like, oh. I, like, I like horror. Like, the crime in them. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I like crime documentary. I don't, I don't like that like, animal so documentary. There you go. Crime. You said, what's your favourite? Crime. I, okay, my favourite genre. Crime, yes. Crime documentary, not animals. Alright. Oh, are you that? I ain't got one still. I don't watch them kind of thing. Alright. If you could hack into someone's phone... Actually, in... sorry. Oh, it's probably a real life person documentary. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? That was watching... What was he watching the other day? Um... Easy E. Like, yeah, like yeah. Easy E. Like a real life person's documentary yeah. I'll sit there and watch. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, this, this one... It's, okay. If you could hack into someone's someone else's phone in the room, who would it be? Well, it's only, only, it only me and you. <laughs> all right, so you're gonna hack into my phone then? I don't need to hack it. I can. I got all the details I need. Yes, Kali. The pin numbers, everything. Yes, Kali. Let's go shopping. That's <laughs> what I'm basically saying. It's mad because if I'm ordering something online, I'd be like, ah, oh, Aaron, what's my what's my three-digit uh, security code? <laughs> you ask me what all for what card for? Uh, I answer. don't remember nothing. That's why it's. I might as well hold on to it. No, no, no. No, no, no. What do you lot think? <laughs> I think I should hold on to it still. My girl. Yes. What are your thoughts on a 30-year-old dating an 18-year-old? Have you had this one already? No, but we talk, we talk about this. Oh, we spoke about yes. it off air. Okay. What, what are my thoughts on a 30-year-old dating an 18-year-old? It's off-key still. It's off-key. You're... I was going to say big man, but you're a big person, whoever it is, male or female, dating a little what, someone that's fresh out. La, la. Or what? No, before I say anymore, what do you, what do you, go on, say your point. You, you're ready to have feel. Me and you have this discussion a lot. Yep. 30 year old dating an 18 year old is nasty. Stay out of the crib. Stay out of the crib. It's nasty. Nasty. Even though they say it's legal and that, but nah. I don't care. It's nasty. It's, it's, it's not right. It's still, it's not right. 
if it was a thing, if it was this is when it becomes acceptable. What's the year difference there? Twelve, yeah. Yeah. So if it was someone was fifty-two, and someone was forty, that's minor. Not um. Not it's a bit more understandable. Mhm. Mm You're both at that same part mm -hmm. on your life, if you get what I mean. Mm -hmm. That 18-year-olds just they don't know what they want and what they where they're going or whatever. You're on two different. Even if you, even if you was a, a, that one percent of person that mature. had was a mature and rare, yeah. rare to, still like like that's a bit wrong. Still, mm -hmm. yeah. Yep. Who do you believe cheats more, men or women? My question. Or that's how you say it. Uh -huh. My my answer is I believe. Men cheat more. Okay. Do I have to explain why? No, actually, fuck it. Men. <laughs> that's that's it. it. Yeah, that's my answer. I would say men probably probably do cheat more. I ain't gonna lie. I believe so because yeah. But don't get it twisted. Women are just as bad as men. Yeah. Just as bad. There is no. You know how back in the day, I'll say, fifteen years ago. You you'd hear that oh yeah men this men that rare 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 you always heard men's the dog men cheat da, 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 da. that's always been the stereotype. Down now fifteen years later, it's become a place where women are just as bad, just women are bad. almost worse in certain things. Men cheat with no feelings and would come home to you with the, who they actually love or rare rare, rare where women cheat emotionally and. And other things, where it's, that's where it's sticky, but that's another combo and chill situation. For real. Yeah. Yeah. Me? Yeah. <sighs> Name a deal breaker for you in a relationship. Deal breaker. Mm -hmm. For me, it's probably something simple as like cheating. <laughs> simple. That ain't simple, but. Okay. My, my deal breaker is. Cheating and getting someone pregnant. That's it. Boom. Done. Feelings drop. Don't know you no more. Don't let dawn all hit you with a good law split you. Gun. <laughs> Deuces. That real. Right. That real. I hear that. I hear that. How do you know when someone really likes you? So I guess for That's you. Just loves. Oh. We can't read. So what? <laughs> How do you know when someone really loves you? Oh, the camera's gonna. Oh, the camera's yeah, overheating. So Ah, uh, we'll be back. Change quality. Mm. Hold it down. P.O.P. And we are back. Mm -hmm. Didn't even tell a difference, did you? Ah, uh, well. But the question was, how do you know when someone really loves you? I would say it's actions. From their actions. That's how you can tell someone really loves you. Explain a bit more. Um, what kind of actions should we they be looking out for if someone really loves them if, and they wanted to know the actions that you should be looking out for is um, if someone thinks about you like just say they went shop or something and they came some, something small it don't have to be nothing big buying you this that and the other could be they went shop and they bring you back your favourite chocolates and or or they bring you back your favourite food or they put you first or there's, there's quite a few things but those kind of things show to show you that someone really love you yeah basically one of the things you said there i agree um when you put in the other person before yourself i believe that's what i've been doing since we've been together would you not say so okay yeah it's a question why you why have to because it seems like you're trying, to, you're trying to say something sorry guys but yeah when the other person Thinks about you, messages you first thing in the morning, last thing at night. That's the early stages of love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, when you don't even put the phone down for 72 hours and that. But anyway. Um, <laughs> you remember the ones? Yep. <laughs> Fall asleep, wake up, still on the phone. Still like, on Rah. the phone. Mm -hmm. Hit that other person snoring and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's nothing. <laughs> but it's nothing. <laughs> but uh, that's when you know it's real love. When someone buys you stuff without even having to ask for it. Um, yeah. Basically. When someone cries, and well, say for a man, for example, you know how men don't really cry? In, mm. for, especially, well, the, men cry, innit? But they don't cry at the same time because they try to hold it in and try to be a man. Mm. But then, 
when you love someone, you you just be yourself, innit? You can't help it. You just you gonna cry in front of who? who, who know what I mean? Mhm. Yeah. Basically, what I'm saying is, yes, I've cried in front of keys before. Yeah, yeah. A couple times. Yeah. It's not a thing about chicken wing. You get me? Basically. Next. Next. Oh, did, <laughs> did I not read that? I read. Oh, that's <laughs> waited. <laughs> okay. Are you okay with paying for the first date? Yeah. I'm. I'm old school, so I would. I expect the man myself to pay for the the every or the first date or whatever but but I'm the type of person don't make it always one sided or don't try don't assume every time we go out I'm paying it will be nice for you to oh, offer oh. say oh can let me pay my ha a half of mm -hmm. or da -da -da -da, let me pay for you know what I mean and then that's when I'll shut you down I'm like no no I got I'll this mm -hmm. from when I know you Sorry, the reason my hands here is because I'm trying to tie up my hair. But anyway, from when you do that, that's when I know you're a real one. If you don't do them kind of things, then yeah, mm. you're greedy. Yeah, but basically. Women of today, I don't know if you call them women or girls. I don't know. Utes. But they, yeah, they expect the man to pay for everything. everything. Swan, him for the pay the bills. Mm -hmm. the, uh, the the rent, sorry. Hundred percent. Her car. Mm -hmm. Gas, mm -hmm. all, yeah, all of them, food, grocery, food, everything. groceries, and go out every time. Mm -hmm. But all man does is w work in the supermarket. So where's he get money for? For all of that? You know what I mean? And then she's gonna drop him because he can't cater to her needs. Girl, if you don't get out of here, man. <laughs> get out of here. Yeah. What have you got to? What is offer? Yeah. Apart from sex. This, this, this is what I mean by we're gonna stop using these as well. Sometimes we're just gonna have Bring our own, topic. own little yeah, conversation because yeah, yeah. it just got me thinking. Yeah, we have a lot of these these discussions, discussions amongst ourselves. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that just got me thinking. Like, mm. oh, what did I just say? I forgot. What you have to offer? Yeah, <laughs> like all these girls that want men to pay this. Da -da 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 -da. Mm. All you bring is the pumps. So, excuse me, is the vagina. Oh shit. Yeah? And that's <laughs> yeah. not even bringing that nothing because you don't, probably ain't doing nothing anyway. The man's doing the work. Probably. Anyway. Lazy. Anywho, that's not where I was trying to go with this. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what I'm basically trying to say is, yeah, allow it, innit? So get over yourself. You're not a million. You're not a million. You're only ten. So, you know, st stoop down a level. Once, once you've become something can earn something yourself then you can almost say have a foot to stand on and say certain things from when you are working in Sharon is working in boots putting on people's makeup and that and you want you're telling Jimmy that works in Iceland to go and pay for your da -da 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 -da. get out of here is what I'm saying yeah get out of here stupid 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 don't make no sense mm -hmm. Stupid yeah. money don't make no money. Oh, we're not talking about money, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, so, quick, back to the question. Are you okay with paying for the first date for me? It depends, man. Because obviously, as a female, it's a bit different than paying for the first date. But I would do 50-50 for the first date. 100%. 50-50 I would. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Whose opinion weighs more to you when deciding who you want to be in your long-term relationship with? Wait, hold on. Who opi whose opinion weighs more to you when deciding who you want to be in a long-term relationship with? Your parents or your friends? <clears throat> whose opinion weighs better to me, yeah? Than deciding who wants to who you want to be in a long long-term relationship with. None of them. I was gonna say none of them. It's my business. I'm laying down with them. I mean, you know what I mean. That's what it can be. I was gonna say that. None of but them. But then I was gonna say if I had to choose though. If I had to choose, I can't. Because it's a thing where I listen to people's opinion. Rare to rare. What keeps it? I listen to everyone's opinion. Rare to rare. But ultimately, you know what should be what's best for you in a way. If you don't, then you're an idiot. But you you should know what's best for you. So you're you're getting people's advice, but then ultimately you're gonna come up with your own thing anyway mm -hmm. from that. Mm -hmm. But in this instant, who would I listen to more? Probably my friends. The reason why? Because they know me more. They know I'm I'm with I'm more 
I wouldn't say I'm, I'm not ever fake, but I'm more real. They see with the real them. you. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. They, they, they see me look at, oh, look at <laughs> Susan with a mini skirt on. You know, I wouldn't do that in front of my parents. Mm -mm. My dad, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> my dad, I would. You know what I mean? But mm. not with my mum. So, yeah. certain levels, certain boundaries. So, that's why in this instant, I would definitely choose friends. Mm. Yeah. Did you answer? Yeah, I said none of them. Well, yeah, well, yeah, alright, cool. Last one, guys. <laughs> Last one. Last one. So, man, I've got fluff where I'm on my mouth. I know I've been doing this a lot. I think it's like this giving me fluff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, which celebrity, celebrity's death affected you the most? Affected me the most? None. No. None. I didn't, I didn't cry over none of them. And that sounds bad, but I didn't cry over none of them. It's not that it didn't touch man and all of that, rare tear, rare tear. I just understand. What life what is. What kind of life? What life is and what life they were living. Not, yeah, not even for me. It's not even about what life they were living. Just what life is. What that everyone dies. Everyone dies. So, goes, so if if next one neighbor dies, you're gonna be like, oh well, it's life. Not everyone oh dies, well. Kind not of oh well, but it's like raw. I'm not surprised, isn't it? How <laughs> you know what I mean? It depends on how they died as well. Then I guess if it was that the person was, tw like for example, extension. Mm. How did he die, actually? Overdose. Yeah, drop overdose. Someone like Extension, flipping... Yeah. yeah, um... That hit a lot of people. I know I know some people that it affected and that, but... It didn't affect me like that. He put himself in that position. It sounds mad and bad. But then you can say that for everyone. That, it, like I said, that kind of lifestyle. Because gangbangers... A gangbanger might get shot, dead, mm. die. Oh, that's... He put that's himself in that life. position. Kind of thing. Why? I'm, yeah, I'm in the. I'm. I don't know. Yeah, I. Yeah. That's why I will just. I'll just be. It's normal, man. It's life. It's life. We are here. We are born to die. Don't. If you don't understand that, not you, because mm. I poked you. Sorry. <laughs> if you don't understand that, then that's on you. Because I always say to Keeps, I don't fear nothing. I don't fear. We literally had a conversation before we started this video about facing fears and mm. rete rete. He was saying, uh, talking about the camel, the camel, like she wouldn't want to ride a camel, like because she's scared of heights and that and they're tall. Nah, 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 nah. I get that, but I was just saying to her, but you've been on a plane, you've done, um, you've done, you've done, must have done something. You know what I mean? That like she's faced the fears to multiple certain, times, multiple times mm -hmm. for her to, for her to to say that she doesn't want to jump on a camel because of da 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 da. I didn't really accept that because it's like you've done better, you've done worse. You know what I mean? Like you, that's something easy you can come from, move from. Where am I going with this? Me no, no. Basically, I was making, <laughs> what was I saying before all of that? That we live to die. Uh, yeah, like Basically. that's what like, I don't live in. Oh, that's what I was saying because what we were saying. I don't live in fear. The only person I fear is God, and even then, I don't fear. I understand. There's once once you understand, there's, there's no fear. You know what I mean? You can take my take, God touch wood. I could be ill to, and drop sick or something, die today, whatever. I'm not afraid. I know. I know who I am, who I was, where I'm at, where I'm going, kind of thing. So that's I'm at one with that. I don't. I don't. No, I ain't crying over. There's one. I don't think I would cry, but it's one person that it would affect me because I wouldn't be able to. I, I feel like you'll hear cry. Their, hear their voice again. If let me say, let me tell you, people. Everyone if, knows by now. The if man eight times little this Wayne dies, huh, he will be he will be in tears. I wouldn't be in tears. You'll be in tears. I'll just be upset. I'll be upset. Because a tear will roll down your eye. I don't know. I think it will. I don't know. So. A tear will roll down his eye. I don't think so. Don't get me wrong. I can. I've got a mad. I've got a. a, a a, a, a heart. Empathetic heart. That's the word. <laughs> I've got an empathetic heart because even watching certain movies and... Or it doesn't have to be a movie. It could be a YouTube video. When it's something real, I feel it. And I'm like I said about man, I stop myself from crying sometimes. You don't. Because I almost feel like I shouldn't be crying. But sometimes it's you dumb. just... Yeah, yeah, yeah. You think like that. No, but we're at those kind of things. Empathetic moments. What? And our bar the same way. That's because you're female. I don't you, care. You Give me from tissue. A, I'll you cry. You move off your emotions. No offence <laughs> to, um, to women. But you look, move off of your emotions. 
we I don't move with my emo I try not to anyway, move with my emotions. I try to move with knowledge, full f what, what why are you yeah. for me? Because you're talking. I thought you were looking at me like I'm trying to No. <laughs> I said move on knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> Like, yeah, knowledge of what's right, what's wrong, yin, yang, black, white, you know what I mean? Grey. I look for... Nah, that's what I'll move off. Yeah. <sighs> I'm going to do more of these. You get to ex talk, mm. explain, you get to say how you feel, and mm. But, yeah, this is good. It's been a good shit chat. Yeah. Feel good, basically. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. That's all she be doing. Yeah, that's my input. <laughs> <laughs> well I actually hope you guys enjoyed this video like I said before if you haven't already please subscribe follow our journey we appreciate every and every and each every and, each and every one of you we thank appreciate you. thank you mm -hmm. we really do um don't put on the notification bell as well um, tell a friend to tell a friend to tell that person's auntie to tell the dog to remind the um, parent to subscribe to subscribe mm -hmm. you won't be disappointed I had to think about it no you won't be disappointed you won't be um, young YouTubers in the game coming up you know what I'm saying yep if you got any ideas or video ideas you want to see from us please let us know in the description below mm -hmm. no in the comments below yeah um <laughs> and if yeah. you like what you see subscribe to we uh, because there's plenty of cheese where that came from and it's been your boy Diggs and your girl Keith and we are over and, and out oh yeah bang Diggs on his back